The publishing of a graphic photo of a man who died in police custody has landed activist and Justice of the Peace Rodney Monker in some hot water. Well, today he was hauled before the courts, accused of committing a grossly indecent act. Our Carissa Robinson has the rundown on today's court proceedings. I committed no crime! I'm a justice of the peace. Even before Rodney Monker was arraigned before Deputy Chief Magistrate Carolito Bethel, he pleaded for freedom, freedom, spread the word. As he was escorted, handcuffed by police into the Nassau Street complex, Monker continued shouting. No, Mark no, my no, wife, no, no, no. the 4th of April, they're going to kill me. Mark my wife, they're going to kill me. Mark my wife. They're going to kill me! Mark my word! According to court dockets, Monker publicly committed an indecent act by posting a photograph of the body of 33-year-old Jamie Smith, who died in police custody on February 8th. He allegedly posted a graphic photo of Smith on his Facebook page sometime between March 1st and March 29th. Speaking to reporters Thursday on the matter, Police Commissioner Allison Greenslade condemned such acts. This issue of posting nude pictures of people, obscene pictures of people, whether they are alive or dead or injured, is an area that's going to get you into grave problems. And I sound that clarion call this morning, and I demonstrate by action how serious I am about that. Appearing before the deputy chief magistrate, Monker had to be sternly warned several times. During the proceedings, the 56-year-old claimed that there is a blatant conflict of interest in appearing before Magistrate Bethel, whose husband he claims is suing him on behalf of Atlantis Resort. He went on to say that it would be unfair for her to read his charge. The judge, however, proceeded and warned Monker to conduct himself properly in the court of law. She reminded him that the court is not not a political arena. After electing for his matter to be tried in the Supreme Court, the judge granted Monker $7,500 bail with two sureties. However, he objected to the bail amount, claiming that he or his wife could not afford to pay it. He told the judge that his wife, who works for him, only makes a slave's pay of $100 per week and insisted that she or no other person could sign his bail. So Mr. Monker will be spending the night in Her Majesty's prison. He will return to court tomorrow at 2 p.m. when the prosecution will decide whether it will proceed by a preliminary hearing or voluntary bill of indictment. Charisma Robinson, ZNS Network News.